So if you're in the metal business like I am, uh, fabrication and welding, you know how important your tape measure is to you. And when it fails on you, especially first thing in the morning on a Monday morning, you get kind of irritated, especially when you buy expensive ones like this. These are 30, 32 bucks a piece. And when it goes through and breaks on you, when the tape breaks, so much so that you can't even pull it out anymore, you get mad and you want to shoot it. So that's what we're going to do today. We're going to figure out what the AK-47 does against the Stanley Fat Max 35 foot tape measure. Now I have no expectations that this thing is going to be bulletproof, but I just think it's going to be fun. So I got it sitting way out there. I don't know if you can see it out there on the sawhorse, but uh, bring out the trusty AK and see what happens. You know, I was really hoping that, uh, that you know, it would explode and like the tape would go, go all over the place with the spring loaded, but it went in here and came out here. So like I said, not bulletproof. Let's shoot it again. All right, time for round number two. I saw something fly that time. Let's go check it out. Now that is more like it. Entry wound is there. Exit wound is there. That is more like it. That's what I wanted to see. Damn tape measure breaking on me in the middle of the day or beginning of the day on Monday. Imagine that, it still doesn't work. So, <laughs> I hope that got on film. <laughs> oh, you guys have got to come see this. That is what I'm talking about. Oh, the carnage. <laughs> Look at that. That makes me feel so much better about Monday morning. Yeah, that makes me feel better. So that's it. That's the fun with the uh, AK and a 35 foot Stanley Fat Max tape measure. I'm going to show this to my next one that I buy and it'll be too scared to break. We'll talk to you guys later.